So what do you do when you see the Googans coming out on the water? Well, you do like everybody else. You go ahead and pull your camera out and start to record. Oh my God, I can't believe he, uh, he deserves to get stuck. Sometimes the sandbars will pop up out of nowhere, which is kind of excusable when you wind up hitting them, but the ones that I just don't understand is when you know the sandbar is there and you're just not quite ready for it, kind of like this crew. Looks like these guys will be enjoying an extended beach vacation. And speaking of extended beach vacations, have you ever thought about taking your boat to the Bahamas? Are you going to be at the boat show at the end of the month in Fort Lauderdale? If so, hang out to the end of the video. We got some info for you. While this crew has it a little rough, I guess there's definitely worse places to be stuck on the water. I've heard the old terminology, being stuck between a rock and a hard place. How about being stuck between a bridge and a hard place? This crew shows you what that's like. Speaking of drinks, these ladies thought they were going to relax, enjoy a little sun and a little drink hanging out on the beach, but one of their husbands had a different plan in mind. And speaking of being stuck on bridges again, it always surprises me just how strong these masts are on these sailboats that it can always pick the bow up. Ah, uh, the sweet boat ramp, the king of boating comedy. Now, of course, we expect to see things go wrong down there, and many people, in efforts to try and avoid things go wrong, sometimes they'll hire the professionals to do it. But I'll tell you what, that plan doesn't always work either. Now, as we mentioned a little earlier, the boat ramp may be the king of comedy, but I'll tell you what, Bridges are giving the boat ramp a run for its money in this episode. It's always interesting to me to see how these things unfold at Bridges. I mean, typically there's a sign on the bridge telling you the clearance, so you should know exactly how much room you have, but yet somehow these people still manage to hit it. Now I say that one's a little unbelievable, but the reality is I'm not sure which is worse, hitting the bridge or finding yourself in a spot like this. Now, the bridges did a pretty good job in this episode, but the boat ramp shows us exactly why it is the king of comedy around the water. As we mentioned earlier in the episode, are you guys going to the Fort Lauderdale Boat Show at the end of the month? Have you ever thought about taking your boat to the Bahamas? Well, guess what? We've got an opportunity for you. We're going to be hosting a seminar in collaboration with the Bahamas Tourism Ministry on how to take your vessel to the Bahamas. So if you're going to be at the Fort Lauderdale Boat Show Thursday, October 26th or Friday, October 27th, we'll be hosting seminars at the convention center in the seminar booth at 11 a.m. both days. There we'll actually announce our dates for our 2024 Bahamas trips where you'll have an opportunity to sign up to actually join us on one of our trips in the Bahamas, so look forward to seeing you guys there. Thanks for watching this episode of Googans of the Week. If you ever see anything crazy happening out on your waterways, be sure to hit us up on Facebook or Instagram and let us know, and you might see your stories over here, just like Content 2.0, Katie Dixon, Claver 4, and Luis Velasquez did this week. And if you haven't already, go ahead and drop an anchor on the subscribe button here.